Okay, you guys, so the time has finally come where I need to unenvelope my Tomo credit card. Uh, it's been a while. I've actually had this credit card for over a week without unenveloping it, but I'm finally going to do it in this video. But before we get started, I have a quick message. Welcome to another video. If you're new here, my name is Dwayne with How to Build Credit TV, and on this channel, I talk about everything you need to know about credit, credit cards, and how to make money using credit cards. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Okay, so the Tomo credit card, it's an interesting credit card. It's really more of a charge card than it is a credit card. And one of the main reasons that I decided to go ahead and apply for the card, other than having a YouTube channel about credit cards, um, is because there is no hard inquiry to get this card. So I'm going to unenvelope it real quick just to kind of show you guys what the card looks like. And then I'm going to show you on my computer screen um, kind of, I guess what the big deal is, air quotes, about the Tomo credit card. So I got my little envelope here that I've had for over a week. I'm going to go ahead and just unenvelope it right here on the screen with you guys. Um, so give me a second here. I'm, I'm doing this, this unenveloping situation here. All right. So I got that opened. Um, and there, it's just a card. It's like a like a postcard. It says, <laughs> let me see if you guys can't see that. It says, Tomo, uh, your Tomo is here. Your Tomo, like tomorrow, is here. And then on the back, it just says TomoCredit.com. Um, so it's like a it's just like a, a like a regular card. That is super interesting. Oh, this is nice. There's a QR code here that you use to activate your card. So this is interesting. It doesn't have any information on the front of the card. It just has inside the envelope. This is what you get. Of course, you guys, the camera will have to focus. Um, there's nothing there. Just that QR code at the top. Um, I think that's pretty interesting. Um, and this is what my card looks like. Of course, all the information is on the back of the card. Um, you know, like the card number, your name, expiration date. Uh, but the front of the card looks just like this this is a nice little cheap plastic card let's see if i can get the the phone to the phone the camera to focus on the card sorry you guys that's what it looks like so this is my tomo card and on this card i only have 500 dollars um so it's pretty cool it says uh log in to activate your card build credit interest free and then of course it says get cash back so this is a cash back card I do believe that you have to pay this card off in full. Um, it's an interesting card. I mean, part of the reason why I went ahead and applied for it um, was because there was no hard inquiry. I think that is one of the things that made it insanely easy for me to decide to pull the trigger, trigger, <laughs> for me to pull the trigger on this card because it was like, a uh, free credit card application. Yeah, so the fact that there is no hard inquiry definitely made it a lot easier to pull the trigger on this card. So um, I wanna show you guys here on the computer screen. Um, I wanna show you, look at the marketing here. This is kinda cool, this is this is funny. I just typed in a Google and it's like, Tomo credit card, no credit score needed. Tomo, the next generation of credit card catered to young adults, students, and immigrants looking to build a better financial future in the US, apply today. I thought that was pretty interesting. Uh, so I was like, let me go ahead and share that with you guys just because I think that's really freaking funny. All right. So I'm going I'm going to go ahead and click on uh, the site here. It's going to bring me in and uh, it's pretty simple. Basically, you have to join a waiting list. So I did a video two months ago and I guess I will be sure to link that video at the top right of this video. Um, I did a video a couple of months ago talking about the Tomo card. So um, of course, you guys can check that out, um, <clears throat> but it's pretty simple. You come to the website, uh, you enter your email address, and you join a waiting list, and then they will email you when it's your time to apply for the app for the Tomo card. It's clearly kind of different, but you know, once again, there's no hard inquiry. Um, so one of the things to definitely be mindful of, even though there's no hard inquiry, getting this credit card, the Tomo credit card, is still going to affect your credit score because it can affect your average age of credit. Now your average age of credit is 15% of your score. So 15% 
out of 850 is 127.5. I'm not telling you that to freak you out. I'm just telling you that even though there's no hard inquiry, your credit score may still dip, especially if the Tomo credit card affects your average age of credit. So that's something to kind of keep in mind. So the website here is pretty clean. Um, it's a very good looking website. Of course, you can navigate the site a bunch of different ways. Um, you can click on the card here. And of course, it has a black card here, but that's not. this is not the card that I actually got in the mail. Uh, I'm not sure why it's different, but they're comparing it to different cards, which I don't know why they would do that, but it's here. Uh, there's no fees, there's zero APR, which is very, very, very good. It says our only goal is to help you build a credit score and save money. That's it. So there are no fees and no and 0% APR. That's really, really good. Of course, you have the ability to earn 0% cash back on all your purchases. Nothing special there, but at least you do have that ability. Uh, and then, of course, it talks about customizable credit limit. So it says, since we do not rely on a credit score to determine your credit limit, we have the flexibility to update your credit limit in real time. Credit limits range from $100 to $10,000. So just to give you guys an idea, when I applied for the card, um, I had to link my checking account from, you know, I have bank with Navy Federal. So you have to link your checking account. If you have an online account, it's pretty easy to do because you just select your bank and then you will go ahead and log into your account, but you're still on the Tomo site and that's how it links your account. And they look at your checking account, um, you know, history or transaction history to determine your credit limit. Now I got $500. Just to give you guys an idea, at the time of my application, I had over $2,000 in my checking account. Um, and so I got a $500 limit. Not sure why it wasn't more, but I got approved and there was no hard inquiry. So I was really, really glad about that. Um, of course, once again, there's different things to click on at the top here. You can click on Why Tomo, and then it talks about the same thing I just mentioned uh, as far as uh, you know, the no credit score needed. Um, no fees. Uh, it's pretty good. I mean, this site is very, very clean. I thought it was very funny that they said that this card is for students or immigrants. And I'm like, wow, that's interesting. Of course, there's an FAQ section here. And you guys can see there is a bunch of questions here that they have for you guys. I mean, there's answers provided about the card itself. It says, what is the Tomo card? Of course, you can click on that and read about that. Um, it says, what type of card is Tomo? Then it says, the Tomo card is a credit card with a seven day automatic payment schedule. We do this so you can build your credit score more quickly. So in other words, you can pay your credit card once a week, which is good because supposedly it's gonna be reported to the credit bureaus more frequently. And that's how you're going to kind of build, uh, you know, payment history quicker in a sense. I say quicker in a sense because if you're making more payments to some extent, uh, if it's being reported, if it's reported every seven days because you can pay weekly, then I guess you're, you're, you're getting more payment history reported. It says, does Tomo report to all three credit bureaus? Yes. That one's very, very simple. Um, so anyway, there's just a bunch of different information here on the FAQ page in case you guys want to know um, more about the Tomo card. All in all, I think it's a decent card. You know, once again, I decided to do it because there was no hard inquiry and I'm just like, sweet, another free application. Um, you will have to provide personal information at different points of the application, but rest assured, I am used to applying for stuff like this. Uh, one of the things for you guys to look at when you're applying at the website is this little lock here at the top left of the screen in the address bar. If there's a lock there, it normally means that the website is secured. Okay, so if you see that there, that means it's a secured site. You normally see that. And you also normally see uh, HTTPS, and the S means secured. I don't know why it's not showing here, but you normally see that. Uh, you guys can see it at the bottom of the screen, actually. Um, but anyway, that's that's beside the point. So anyway, I just want to do a really quick video showing you the unenveloping process. It's so simple and minimalist. I mean, literally, it's just a card, right? And then your Tomo card is in here, just like this. And there's a QR code that I'm covering up right there. Um, but this is pretty much it. This is what the card looks like. Um, and I think it's a decent card. I mean, once again, no hard inquiry. 
So depending on what they approve you for, you can always decide to uh, go ahead and get the card or not get the card. All right, so that's pretty much it about the Tomo card. Uh, feel free, we do live streams here on How to Build Credit TV on Mondays at 7 p.m. Central. So feel free to join the live streams at seven o'clock Central Time on Mondays to have your questions answered live on How to Build Credit TV. Also, be sure to give the video a thumbs up. It helps the channel tremendously. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet, all right? Once again, my name is Dwayne with How to Build Credit TV, and I approve this video. I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, take care and be blessed. Peace.